Also in the South Valley tonight, home and business owners continue to prepare for the worst as the Kings River is also on the brink of overflowing. Tonight, our Esteban Reynoso attended a community meeting in Kings County where residents voiced their concerns. Around 100 people packed into this elementary school cafeteria door right behind me, many of them telling us that they feel better leaving than they did arriving, but they understand that the worst of this flooding is ahead of them. Prepare and pray. So we're that's what we're doing. We're preparing. Marilyn Vieira and other concerned homeowners packed into Island Union Schools cafeteria. It was standing room only. Those living near the river tried to get as many of their questions answered as possible by county officials. We don't know how much we're going to get and when we're going to get it, but it's going to come and we want to be prepared when it gets here. Kings County Supervisor Doug Verboon put this meeting together, moving it to a bigger venue from the first meeting, but keeping the reason behind it the same. You know, we have this snow melt that's going to melt, it's going to come into fine flat. There's going to be a time where we go into uh, overflow capacity and flood stage. Uh, that's going to be the key time we have to really be prepared. And so right now we're just trying to bring calm to the community and let them be prepared. The community's biggest concern is the water in the surrounding rivers rising enough to go over the levees. Pine Flat Dam can hold 1 million cubic acre feet of water, but projections say up to 3.2 million cubic acre feet will pass through the dam. Right now, the spillway is letting out roughly 22,000 acre feet per second. My response to that is prepare. Uh, I, I really don't know what else to say. Plenty of volunteers are to do that to help you out. And one of those volunteers was Marilyn Vieira. Volunteering at the sand piles, and because there's a lot of people that may need help for one reason or another. Even if some of those questions weren't answered, Vieira says it's the camaraderie that will get her and the community through. Came in the meeting pretty apprehensive, and I left. I'm not reassured about the flood. I, I'm reassured about the community coming together. Supervisor Verboon says that he plans to hold another one of these meetings in two weeks time. Till then, he says that sandbags will be available at any local fire station. In Kings County, Esteban Reynoso, KC24 Local News and Matters.